I'm here at Westinghouse with Brett Clapham, and we're looking at the Westinghouse solar system. Now, Brett, I'm going to ask you, what makes this roof-mounted solar panel a little bit different from many others out there? So, thanks, Bob. And what's different about this is this is the first panel that you can buy, panel by panel, solar system. So you're not buying a huge system, but you can buy it one panel at a time if you want. How much can one single panel power in my house? One panel is going to produce about 250 kilowatt hours, and that's that unit that you'll see on your electric bill, Bob. And you can think about that. What does that mean in terms of something that could power in your home? A typical computer uh, is something that you could power with one panel throughout for an entire year. I mean, how many panels am I going to need for my, to do my entire house? Uh, it's going to vary quite a bit from various areas of the country, but let's just talk about 20 panels per se. That's going to probably offset about half of a of that house's electrical needs. What are you anticipating most people are going to set up up there? A real common starter system is about eight panels. So let's say I've got your typical 2,300 square foot home and I've decided to spring for all 20 panels roughly. Uh, what am I going to pay? So that system is going to probably cost about $15,000. There's a 30% federal tax credit and then depending on where you live there's going to be state and or local utility rebates that are going to be available to you. So in many cases that price of $15,000 can be cut roughly in half. That's pretty good. So now it's what kind of a payback period are you talking then probably for a typical system? It varies quite a bit. And we've studied everywhere from Hawaii to New York, New Jersey, Texas, and, and California. And what we found is you're going to see a payback as fast as three years and sometimes up to 10 years. That's good news considering some of the solar water heaters Consumer Reports tested took up to 26 years to pay for themselves. I guess that could be even more sunny news for at least a few homeowners out there.